In this rapidly evolving technology landscape, organizations have many choices to back up their defense mechanisms and understanding these tools and systems that keep their uh, digital environments secure is crucial. Today, we talk about two of them, XDR Extended Detection and Response and its managed counterpart MXDR. Although both provide advanced threat detection and response features, understanding the differences between them is vital for companies looking for the most suitable security solution. XDR is a system that integrates and correlates information from multiple security solutions and data sources across an organization's network, cloud environment, and endpoints. Its goal is to provide a unified view of potential security threats and streamline the detection and response process. The most important XDR features are broader visibility, automated threat detection, correlation of data across sources, swift incident response, threat intelligence integration, unified incident view, behavioral analysis, improved investigation capabilities, integration, and scalability. MXDR managed extended detection and response builds on previous generations like MDR and XDR to enhance security across an organization's attack surface. MXDR refers to the managed version of XDR. It involves outsourcing the management and operation of the XDR product to a third-party service provider. This can help organizations with limited cybersecurity resources and expertise to benefit from the capabilities of XDR without the burden of day-to-day -day management. Most important features of MXDR Enhanced security expertise, 24-7 monitoring, reduced overhead, up-to-date threat intelligence, incident response, integration, and management. Now let's take a look at each solution's approach. XDR systems collect and analyze data from multiple security tools such as endpoint detection and response, network detection and response, and more. By aggregating and correlating this data, XDR platforms aim to provide a holistic view of potential threats and attack patterns, enabling faster and more accurate threat detection and response. MXDR takes the concept of XDR a step further by offering uh, managed services. In addition, to the technology, MXDR providers also offer dedicated security experts who monitor and respond to threats on behalf of the organization. This alleviates the company's internal team from the constant monitoring and management of the XDR solution. Organizations implementing XDR need to deploy and set up the XDR platform themselves. This involves integrating various security tools and ensuring proper data collection and correlation. With MXDR, the organization partners with a managed security service provider, MSSP, that offers XDR as a managed service. The provider takes care of the setup, configuration, monitoring, and response activities. XDR provides a consolidated view of security data, helping organizations detect and respond to complex threats that might otherwise go unnoticed. It gives internal security teams greater control over their security operations. MXDR offers the benefits of XDR along with the advantages of outsourcing. Companies can benefit from the expertise of the managed security provider, receive 24-7 monitoring, and have access to experienced analysts without needing to build and maintain an internal security operations center. Organizations implementing XDR need to have the internal resources and expertise to manage and operate the solution effectively. They are responsible for keeping the platform up to date, tuning it for optimal performance and handling incident response. While MXDR offloads the operational burden, organizations need to carefully select a reputable and and reliable managed security service provider. Trusting a third party with sensitive security operations requires thorough due diligence and strong communication. While XDR offers organizations the tools to detect and respond to threats, managed XDR provides expertise, 24-7 monitoring, and hands-on response services. In the end, the choice between them boils down to a company's internal resources, expertise, and desired level of involvement in security operations. Thanks for watching. As always, if you find this video useful, make sure you show us your appreciation, share it with the world, and come back for more. See you next week.